Hello and welcome to Office Concept TV, where we give you the latest news, gist, and gossips. If you are a new subscriber, please do not forget to click on the subscribe button and also turn on your notification post to get all the latest updates. Also, if you are an old subscriber, we say thank you for subscribing to our channel. And do not forget to tell your friends and families to subscribe to Office Concept TV. Thank you very much. And now to the news of today. First, the headline. Peter Obi laments exclusion of Nigeria after 16 African countries got selected for Harvard Business School 2025 Immersion Course Program. Now to the news in full. Peter Obi laments Nigeria's negative image as Harvard Business School Class of 2025 program settled for Kenya, Ghana, Morocco, and Rwanda in its immersion course, he said. Nigeria's negative image was on display as Harvard Business School Class of 2025 program has selected 16 countries for its global immersion course but notably excluded Nigeria, despite the program leader being a Nigerian professor. Instead, Kenya, Rwanda, Morocco, and Ghana were chosen as the four African-focused countries for this initiative. This program aims to teach students leadership, teamwork, and cross-cultural understanding by immersing them in different continents, cultures, and areas. The students have chosen Nairobi, Kenya, as their first preference and have been attached to various Kenyan companies to study and present solutions to real-world problems. This omission of Nigeria is particularly striking, given the country's potential and capabilities. Unfortunately, Nigeria's reputation and attractiveness to international institutions and investors has recently been severely impacted by major obvious drawbacks. The Class of 2025 program demonstrates the power of collaboration and knowledge sharing between institutions and countries. Hopefully, Nigeria will take note of these shortcomings and strive to improve its reputation and attractiveness within today's global community. That is the challenge of the new Nigeria that remains ever possible. P.U. Well, I, mean, I don't think there is any shortcoming. If Harvard has a business school in their country, we also have Lagos Business School in Nigeria. And I'm sure there are various business schools across the, the, the nation. We should only strive to make our own business school here in Nigeria, in Lagos, better. We should make it sought after that people outside the country would even want to come and learn in our own country. We should strive to make our country better. And not trying to seek validations from other countries and Harvard University, Harvard Business School did, omitted Nigeria. They did not pick Nigeria. They should, we should strive to make our own country better, to make our own things better, so that they also will come from their country to come and learn from us. That is what I think. I don't think there is any shortcoming or there is any need for us to be wanting them to to pick us to pick us for everything we should strive to make our own country better make them see us as a country that they want to go to that is what we should strive for that is what the government should strive for and that is what i think my listeners what do you think kindly leave your thoughts in the comment section and please do not forget to like to share and subscribe to our youtube channel thank you for always listening to us See you some other time.